Hello, I couldn't help but notice that everybody loved my previous lobby glitch guide video, so here I am again making part 2. In this video, I'll go over the basic glitches again and feature one new duck game glitch that the community has found. So let's get right into it. First, of course, we have the original duck through the beam glitch. This allows you to get into any one of the four slots. To do this, simply run ragdoll into the beam, and before you enter, you want to hit pause and then unpause. This will clip you through the beam onto the other side. If you want to get down, simply pause the button for hit the pause button for a few seconds longer to fall farther down into the beam. But make sure to unpause quickly though, because if you go down too far in the beam, you will die due to a death barrier. Now that we're down here, how in the world do we get back up? Well, there are many ways to do this. First, the easiest way: slide jump into the ceiling. So to do this, you want to slide jump into the two corners of the ceiling, and then once you hit the ceiling, you want to ragdoll. This will clip you into the top slot. However, this does not work in slot 4, the orange duck. If you do this in slot 4, you will die to another death barrier. So, once you're at the top, there's another way to get down. This is by floor clipping. This takes some time but can be done. You want the rag doll into the corner inside floor. It's kind of difficult to do, but it'll take time and will eventually be accomplished. So, another way to get down is by an odd gun clip. To do this, you want to slide strafe into the outer corners of either slot 1 or 2, and ragdoll you, and you will fall through the floor onto the other side. This is a very fun way to do this. And another thing you can do with guns is throw them through the beam. This is the easiest glitch to do out of all of them. All you have to do is throw the gun and hit pause. It's that easy. There's no ragdolling. There's nothing. You just throw the gun and then hit pause and it goes directly through the beam. But a harder thing to do with guns is have them in the beam. With this glitch, you can shoot the shotgun while inside being in the beam. To do this glitch, you want to bring the gun as close as you can to the edge before entering the beam. And then this is the same process as the duck to the beam glitch. Simply ragdoll, hit pause, and then qu this time quickly unhit pause, and then grab right after. You'll be able to pick up the weapon and have the gun inside the beam. It's difficult to do, and it's one of the hardest glitches to do in the lobby. And this brings us to our final glitch. This is very new and can be used to impress your fellow duck friends. It is surprisingly simple to do, but it does take skill in a certain aspect for casual duck game players. This will require almost perfect angle shooting. To do this final glitch, you have to grab the gun, run to the beam, and then click pause. You don't need a ragdoll, you just have to hit pause and uh, leave it there. But you want to unpause once you're under all of the slots, because in this glitch, you're going to be under every single one of the slots and you're not going to be able to see yourself. So unpause and you're going to want to angle and save yourself before you hit the death barrier. And then from this you can er, you are able to see the head of your duck under the four slots. And then you can just simply angle back up into the tube and come back up and continue changing your hats. So thank you so much for all the support. In the last video we hit over 1000 views. Let's see if we can do the same for this one. I hope you enjoyed and are able to do all of these. Duck on!